Hey guys, it's Chelsea, your independent Sensi consultant. Welcome back to my channel. It's dark. I, I apologize. Um, it's eight o'clock at night <laughs> and, um, I am busy this weekend. So I wanted to make sure I got this video out <sighs> because Monday starts July 1st, which also starts bring back my bar month. So you guys be prepared. Um, I did start warming to bring back my bars since today. Um, so I should have a review coming out within the first, within, within a couple days to let you know how I'm liking them. I started off with, um, my only sunshine and, um, spice pear. So anyway, we've got an empties. I have an empties guys. I'm so excited. We're going to start off with the testers that I went through. Um, so, um, I have quite a bit. <laughs> uh, I have, where is it? Uh, Berry of Paradise and White Tea and Cactus. Um, I just uploaded a video, was it yesterday or the day before? Um, a review of these two because they were scents that I have never melted before. Um, so I will leave that linked down below so you guys can check it out because I don't want this video to be too, too long. Um, needless to say, I'm not a fan of Berry of Paradise. I am loving White Tea and Cactus. I'm going to be purchasing some bars of those, of that because I absolutely love it. So I went through that and my next comparison video, which will either be filmed tonight or probably not until Monday, um, unless I can f try to squeeze it in this weekend, is Pink Cotton and Do We or Don't We. So these are both scents that I've never melted before. Um, so I have a review coming on these as well. So got through those. And one tester that I melted that I have smelled before is Clean Breeze. I need to throw this in my Scentsy Club, guys. I love it. I've, I've loved it ever since I started with Scentsy as a customer. And I thought I had at least like a bar in my stock. I went to go warm it today in um, the guest bedroom because my mother-in-law is flying in on Monday. She lives in a different state, but she's going to be here for the baby's birth. So I wanted just a clean scent in... Um, the, the guest bedroom. So I was coming in, I came into my office for, um, clean breeze and I could not find it anywhere. I don't have it. Um, so I just stuck the tester in there. I was like, I got the tester. I'm just going to stick the tester in there. I love clean breeze. I absolutely love it. Um, this is one that my fiance does not like cold sniff. However, he's loving it warmed up. Like he went to the guest bedroom today and he's just like, what's in here? And I said, clean breeze. And he goes, I really like it. And I was like, <laughs> what? You always tell me you don't like it. But Clean Breeze is also one that I like to have on stock, but I don't really reach for it too much unless I like really want like that really nice clean scent. I do tend to clean, um, warm it a lot during when spring, when we're transitioning from winter to spring and when I can start opening up my windows because it just, it's that perfect spring cleaning scent. I love Clean Breeze. It's so good. So I did go through a tester of Clean Breeze. Um, and as far as bars, guys, I went through three more. I have, I started the month of June with like, I think 12 open and I'm down to five, five being, well, seven, if you count the, um, to bring back my bars that I opened up today, but five from the beginning of the month that I had still going, I went through three more. I went through an entire bar of Atlantic air. You guys know how I feel about this. I love it. I love it. I need to just stick it into my Scentsy Club because it's either going to get stuck into my Scentsy Club or I'm just going to stockpile it in August when it's 10% off. This is such a good, a good scent, a good scent. It reminds me of Clothesline and of Clean Breeze without that laundry note. It's just a strict, like fresh, clean note. Oh, it smells so good. So that is Atlantic Air. I went through all of my sugared strawberry. <sighs> this is a disappointment for me. This is why I always mention Scentsy Club. Um, you guys know this was April's scent of the month. 
and I feel like the same day I was going to go stick this into my Scentsy Club, it sold out. So I'm hoping, I'm hoping Scentsy brings it back for the spring and summer. I don't see a strawberry scent coming for the fall and winter. Hopefully for the spring and summer, Sugar Strawberry comes back. We will see, but I love it. Oh, it is the perfect strawberry scent. It really, really is. And I love it so much. I only had like two cubes left of this because I was going to hold on to it. But I was like, girl, get rid of it. You have like two cubes. It needs to go. So I finished it up. I enjoyed it. I literally waited until I could no longer smell it in the house anymore. Um, And lastly, summer holiday is gone. You guys, if you have, are familiar with my channel, you know I have a love-hate relationship with this scent. It's it's a powerhouse. It's a powerhouse cold sniff. It's amazing. I love it. I, I love it. Even for it being a floral note, I absolutely love this scent, cold sniff. Even in the tester, it smells like it's going to be so super strong. The second I stick it in my warmer, it did nothing. <laughs> nothing. Nothing at all for me. Um... I have a warmer on my desk and when I'm sitting at my desk, you know, doing some work, I can smell it because I'm on top of my warmer. I have two warmers in my master bedroom. I started with one cube of summer holiday in each, in each warmer, could not smell it or could smell it, but it was so light, so light. It, it just, it's, I just finished it to finish it guys. I'm, I'm so disappointed. Like and I'm not the only one. I've heard a lot of people tell me that they've had the same experience with Summer Holiday where they love it cold sniff. It smells like it's going to be a great performer. And then you put it into your warmer and it's just like, meh. So I will not be, purch be purchasing any more Summer Holiday. I wish I could say that I, I was going to because like I said, I love the scent. It's just not a great performer. So that was literally all my empties, guys. I just wanted to get that out before the end of June. Thank you guys so much for watching. Stay tuned for some reviews. Um, again, these next couple weeks are probably going to be a little mushed with um, videos, and they're probably going to be all over the place. Um, every day I'm getting closer to popping, so um, but I'm going to try my hardest to get videos out for you guys. So thank you guys so much, and if you have not subscribed yet to my channel, please come a part of my Scentsy family and subscribe. It would mean the world to me. And until my next video, I will see you guys next time. Bye, guys.